Hey, fine. Look, Carly, there you are. You're on the camera. You're famous. Famous Crowl. He's on the documentary. <laughs> You're so cute. This is Crowley. He's my Harlequin McCall. Um, I've had him for a couple of years. I've had him actually since he was a baby. He can be very friendly or very not friendly, depending on how he's feeling. They're exotic birds that come from South America. You won't see this colour naturally in the wild because he's a hybrid. Hi Crowley. You're so lovely. What a handsome man. Please don't eat my finger. <laughs> hey Crowley. Shoot me. You love me. Are you sure? The other cool thing about having a pet macaw is they leave you their feathers when they molt every year. So you get all of these beautiful feathers that you can make a headdress out of. And here's a usually blue with the gold on the back, which he gets from his mother. And it's really beautiful. Oh, ah! <laughs> so Crowley can do a few tricks. I will attempt to show you guys one now. Shall we show them, Crowley? Oh, hang on. Oh, I got you now. Ha! Ah, I have you. <laughs> Little baby. <laughs> He's so cute. You're a cute boy. Mwah. You're cute. Mwah. But I will say one thing. I do have a lot of people, you know, I watch these videos and I'm always like, oh, don't, you know, don't get a macaw, don't get a cockatoo, don't get a parrot. You know, if you're the right person for them, though, like, they are the most wonderful animals on the entire mm. planet. I love Crowley more than anything else in the world. He's like my child kind of thing. Um, you can see I have a painting of him right there in the background. I actually painted that before he came into existence. I kind of like willed him into existence with magic. And the painting, it looks a lot like him, weirdly. Uh, but he's he's a great guy. I call him Mr. Crowley after Alistair Crowley, the occult magician. So he's a magical bird. Also, for those of you interesting, here's a more up close thing of the painting that I did of the Crowley. Pretty good, right? Anyway, in short, macaws live for like over a hundred years, so you have to include them in your will. They're very expensive, um, uh, so it's something you should definitely think about as a pet before you get one. They need a lot of attention and a lot of love every single day. They can take off your entire finger. They have that much power if they want to. And the key is training and socializing the bird from an early age so that it's not like hyper aggressive and whatnot. And Crowley is pretty cool. You're a pretty cool guy. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to subscribe. Take care.